24-year-old Madison Oliver is loving life, especially when it gets a little messy. Super Chow still there. It's Super Chow up by a length. Super Chow drifts, but does it again, and Super Chow wins the Tom Fool. I feel like I get to live more in like those minute, that minute, two minutes that I'm riding the horses than some people get to live in a year. Oliver, who lives in Valley Stream, made history last month when she became the first female apprentice jockey to win a graded stakes race in New York when she won the Toboggan Stakes. But it's going to be Super Chow and Jockey Madison Oliver. They win the Toboggan. How much fun are you having? So much. Some days more than others, but so much. It's the best. First introduced to horses when she was just 14 months old. My mom just threw me up there. She jogged off with me, just left me hanging there, bouncing in the saddle. Apparently I had a great time. Madison has worked her way up the ranks, winning multiple graded stakes races at Aqueduct and shedding her label as an apprentice jockey. So now she's just one of the guys. I want to look like I'm riding like a guy. I don't want to look like I'm riding like a girl. Being a female in a male-dominated sport isn't the easiest thing, but Maddie says the jockeys and trainers here at Aqueduct have been nothing but great to her. And as for the horses, Maddie says she brings something a little different to the track. I find that I have soft hands. Force and strength is great, and it works with, with a, in a lot of ways, but sometimes a gentle touch can help as well. Madison says the goal is to keep her soft hands, but add a little more muscle. After that, who knows where this sport can take her. After you win a race and you say to yourself, wow, I can really do this, what are the ultimate dreams? Sky's the limit. Even if it gets a little messy. For Newsday TV, I'm Jamie Stewart.